The United States has one of the largest prison populations in the entire world. Despite comprising only 5% of the world's population, we hold 25% of the global prison population. In the U.S., 4% of the adult population identify as lesbian, gay, bisexual, or transgender. Yet, in our prisons and jails, the LGBT population is double that. Among youth in juvenile justice facilities, the picture is even bleaker. 20% identify as LGBT. For girls in juvenile justice facilities, 40% identify as LGBT or gender nonconforming. Like many people in prisons and jails in the United States, they are more likely to be people of color, low income, and have suffered violence in their lives. Why is this? Discrimination and stigma in society result in family rejection, poverty, homelessness, and discriminatory enforcement of laws and outdated laws target LGBT people. Policing tactics like stop and frisk, prostitution enforcement, and profiling impact LGBT people, mostly LGBT people of color. Once in the system, LGBT people rarely get a fair trial, and they often face extreme conditions, including harassment, sexual assault, and lack of medical care. When they leave prison, they face added challenges to rebuilding their lives. A criminal record and discrimination because of who they are can make it difficult to find a job, housing, or reestablish connections with family. The end result is a cycle of incarceration, poverty, and discrimination that can be hard to break.